Pam 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 Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. I'm Kiralis and this is Hermitcraft Season 7, Episode 19, I believe. So just sit back like this, like that. Relax and enjoy. And if you guys do enjoy this, make sure you leave a like on this video. And if you do so, spank you very, very, very much. So ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much once again for the amazing and fantastic support on this series. You guys are breathtaking. So thank you, thank you and spank you. Previous episode, we've made a bot. This is, this is my bot. It does not serve any purpose besides being a bot. It is the Samskip uh, Hoffel Kartoffel. And uh, hopefully one day we will make use of it. Because the space on the inside is, is humongous. I mean, just look at the sheer size of this. And yeah, we kind of need to drain the hull. Because now we have fishes <laughs> swimming inside of it. But uh, like, if we drain this, like, there's, there's space. There is definitely space. Where we can use for something and uh, not sure what but uh, it kind of looks majestic on the inside oh my face i'm alive but for today's episode first things first also there's a new game look look, look at the mice there's a new game in town so we need to check that out but i've clear off uh, clear off a little bit of this land i spoke to beef and he's like yeah you can take it so i'm like okay dokie okay. because what i need I do need like a shack, some type of shack where I can have, uh, what you gonna call it? Like some type of, some type of simple uh, contraptions, like one for maybe concrete, one for cobblestone, stone, like redstone. Yeah, a little bit like se semi redstone uh, contraptions. And I don't really have any space for that over here now. So I'm thinking like make a shack on this side, extend this road, go into that shack and everything is going to be perfect. So what I'm going to be doing, we're going to be clearing off this land. And for some reason, I find this very satisfying to watch when other people do it. So we're going to have a little time lapse. We're going to be using a fantastic lamp and pretty much just, uh, just clear this off with some jazzy tunes. So... So, ladies and gentlemen, we have a clearing. And uh, this kind of took far longer than I expected. And it's not even done yet. I was like, I need to remove this. But then, then I saw Beaver's place. I mean, I, I can't, I can't, I can't go further. Because, I mean, can you just imagine those happy beach girls and then cranes in the distance, ship containers, smoke and smog. No, we can't, we can't. Oh, this is, oh, my face. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this is nice. That that is amazing. That is like oh, this is awesome. Like uh, fish and ice from the from the fishing trip, right? Oh, <laughs> poor chicken. <laughs> I love it though. But uh, but yeah. So the main plan is to not go further than this, and then maybe hide away that with some scenery, maybe some trees and bushes, so they don't really see the the the, the ugliness over here. But I mean, this is a harbor area. It is supposed to be ugly, right? But my main plan for the shack is I'm gonna be using one material which I kind of dislike, <laughs> and that is uh, that is bricks. I am not a big fan of bricks. I don't know why. Uh, but but I'm still going to be using it because obviously harbor region, brick buildings, I mean, that is kind of fitting. So what I'm planning to do is we're going to be doing a little combination. Let's uh, see here. Let's get some polished andesite and let's get... Uh, I don't have any, but I can, I guess, make some. Let's uh, do so and let's uh, do so. Let's get those as well. So, I mean, that is, that is a nice combination. Uh, you might be, but, 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 it, but, is it, but is it really though? And I'm like, yeah, it might be. So this would be the bottom part, right? And then we could have uh, bricks and on all the corners we would have andesites. And, but you might be, but that is, that is kind of poopy. Well, it might be, but then we can uh, incorporate some stairs, brick stairs. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You know what we could also do? We could even... This is thanks to Bubbles, because Bubbles is an amazing builder. Don't I have any? 
I thought I had... There we go. Some granites. We can even incorporate that in between somewhere about. Because obviously, let me see here. So if I would do this, this. And uh, a scene over the bubbles place. Something like that. You know, what? like in a small scale, this looks terrible. But in a big scale, I think this would look really, really nice. Like, trust me. I know what I'm doing. No, I'm not. But uh, let's let's keep this a go. First things first, I'm going to grind a little bit of concrete to make the road, uh, I guess, to begin with. And then we'll see where this takes us. Um, you, by the way, by the way, you might be, oh no, it's going to be building again. I'm like, yeah, I'm sorry. I, I like building, okay? Building is my kind of my forte. Maybe not. Could you call it forte? I like building, so leave corrals alone. Let me just grind some, um, some Greek concrete for the rods. And then we're gonna get back with another time lapse. So you might be no 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 more time lapses. Yes. So I have been doing some sinking. Not sinking, sinking. You know what I mean. So first I was definitely not afraid, and uh, most likely not petrified either. But uh, I was like planning to do like a factory building over here. But that might not be as suiting. Not so close to the to the like the, the main harbor with the ships and such. So I was like, hey. Let's do like a Kerala's logistics company, having a few trucks, containers, maybe some small trucks, some forklifts and such. That might look really snazzy here and we might even have too much space for the task. But we can always terraform it back or landscape it back, I guess. And the only thing is now that we're going to figure out where we're going to take this road out. And I don't want to destroy this beautiful bend because I love it to bits. Ladies and gentlemen, behind me, we have a platform or a canvas to paint all those happy trees and happy accidents, I guess. And I'm not really sure I'm happy with the bend, but for the moment you will have to do. And I have been thinking about adding a crane on this side, because I know people are going to be upset by Cusker Corrales. How are the containers going to get off the ships? And I mean, this guy has the, like those lifty arms, so I guess uh, that is that is a way to go. We can maybe just accept ships which, which, which has those. But... Uh, Maybe we're going to build a crane on this side. And at this stage, it might be, as the Swedes call it, cookie on cookie. Kaka po kaka. Because it might look a little bit too much, uh, having the crane and the logistics center and that and this. But on the other hand, I don't, I don't want to spend my whole season building like an industrial harbor. And I, I feel so bad about those beachgoers, man. They're going to be in the path of destruction, I guess. We'll see where this takes us. And now... I'm gonna sleep and in the morning we start crafting. a shape and uh, love it hate it it is uh, i guess debatable i'm not sure i love it yet but from this point on is uh, adding details and making it a little bit more interesting so what i'm thinking is that we're gonna bring out um, let's just see let's just grab this we're gonna bring out a wall going like that and then we're gonna have that turning with pretty much the same layout like a little like loading uh, loading bay thingy but that's gonna be in a bigger building in the back just to kind of get different like elevations and depths uh, of the build. Otherwise it's gonna look really flat, but I guess it does fit the harbor region. <laughs> What do you guys think about this? Like, uh, 
I think, I think I like it. It is definitely growing on me. Like, it is tricky because we're using, like, what is it, like, five materials or something? And, yeah, it might look a little bit plain. But... Like, I'm not a professional, professional builder in Minecraft by any means, but this is the beauty of it. Like, as soon as you start adding, like, depth to the builds, it just, I don't know, it just brings it to life. Okay, it might look a little bit like a Swiss cheese at this stage. Hey, 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 hey. Don't you guys worry. So what I'm thinking over here, since I can't really move that mound, because otherwise it's going to be sad beef noises on the, on, the, on the horizon, maybe what we could do here is just have, like, a diagonal building. Just to keep it more interesting. And on that far end, let me just... Look at the mouse from here. I'm alive. And on this side over here... Since I'm not going to be destroying that. Well, kind of am. Because of the bulldozer. But uh, but I'm gonna, not going to be touching that. Maybe we can have like a small, uh, small office building. And in the future having a road to the back. Then looping around that somehow. And maybe even have a few train tracks going. Like... Uh, Pointless project? Say yes, yes indeed. But it's my pointless, and I love it. So let's do and let's do the diagonal building and see how that looks. Ladies and gentlemen, we have uh, a shape of something. And you know what? I think I like it. I do think I like it. However, there might just be too much brick. I'm not really sure. And uh, yeah, that pattern, not really sure about the, the, like, the, the holes in the bricks. But uh, you might, is it done? Uh, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. So over here, we're going to have like a little reception office uh, building. Uh, and on the inside, yeah, there's no inside. Uh, it was not really that much left. It's pretty much just the back wall. And I'm not really sure how we're going to have it yet. So I haven't really touched it uh, at all. Ooh. Oh, but, 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 My way. I just can't stop myself. Like, he's like looking to my eyes. Nothing but my eyes. And I'm like, I need to look in your eyes. Oh, no. Look up. Can you, can you, can you please? No, dude. No, no, no. Not like this. Not like this. Come on. Fight me. Doesn't sound like that guy. Who's this guy? Who's who who who, who fights? Who makes out? Oh no! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah. Gotcha. So so yeah, I'm not really sure how we're gonna have the back wall, uh, wall yet, but uh, we need to take this out, and then we're gonna have all the machinery. Like the space on this side is just insane. I'm not really sure about those windows either, but uh, for the moment they will be here to stay. And then we have the diagonal building, which yeah, we just need to dig that away. Uh, B first. Hello, hello. Like I'm getting I'm getting closer and closer to beef, but. This is going to be like as far as I go. So I'm not going to be going closer than that. And and yes, let me just hear. No, we, like, no, we're decent. It's decent, uh, decent space, I guess. That is going to be like the far, as far as I go. And uh, for the beachgoers and the tourists over here. Like, it's hardly noticeable. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. They ain't going to see anything. We're going to hide it away with trees and bushes. And everything's going to be just perfect. So now what I'm going to do... You've been watching a lot of time lapses. And I really hope you guys enjoy the time lapses. But I'm going to do a little bit of decoration. And just roughen up this little area over here. And uh, and then we're going to see how it looks. And hopefully I got time. Because I do want to play the button game as well. And I also want to go into town. Check out Looky Looky at my bookie. And just check out town. But if I get time. We're going to get the crane up and running as well. But first is first. Look into mice. 
Nothing but my eyes. Let's get some uh, some decoration in. Not decoration. I guess details. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, do I love this game? I adore this game. Is this done? No, 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 no. You guys will have to let me know what you guys think about this so far, but um, I'm, I'm semi-happy with it, okay? Uh, we do need the crane, maybe a few containers uh, over here, and I've I've made a logo. I've I've made I've made a logo, and this is supposed to be eyes and and this beautiful mouth but but i don't know like we need a better logo than that this was just like a like a one minute job so we might tweak this uh, i do like the white trailers uh, or maybe adding more color splashes to this place i don't know if you guys come up with a design please do tweet uh, the design to me all right it's gonna be a link for my twitter in the description below this video also forklifts this is based on a design by spaza i'm gonna link that in the description however it is tweaked and modified for my liking and this is how they look you can even like look at this you can even yes oh my face there we go <laughs> i love it is it necessary? No, but it looks kind of cool. And yeah, we did add a little bit of like, uh, this kind of, this over here, the, the, the wool thingy is supposed to be like a patch up job, uh, like, like, a, like a repair job of the, of the, of the concrete or asphalt or whatever. We also have one more forklift over here. And I mean, just envision this in the future, like maybe even hiring zombie Cleo over here. So she could come over here and make a little bit of like a, like a scene with workers and such. That would be kind of neat. But yeah, it is, uh, it, it is a thing. And then we have this uh, slopey down here. So just in case it comes in like, like, like a, I don't know, like a, like a truck without the possibility to, to go into this little thingy over here. They can just go down over here with the forklift and yeah, it's a little bit steep, but but it's Minecraft, all right? And I did kind of kind of keep one thing for last because um, yes, this is going to be annoying, but at the same time, satisfying. You guys ready? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> I love the sound they make. Just, just. like the most annoying sound in the world but at the same time wow wow we we're not done yet you might be cross this is a waste of anvils no mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, no it's not it is definitely not a waste of anvils this is this is what i live for making making anvil sounds because 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 who wouldn't This is like music to my ears. Oh, do I have? Do you? No. Ugh. Okay, we like free. But but uh, but yeah, that's gonna be added and it's gonna be fixed. In between the episodes, what I will do is uh, like a small over here. I will kind of patch this up as well uh, over here. We will add a little few ladders, like just in case you kind of fall down into the to, to the bay over here to the to the dock. You can just go up with the ladder and whatnot, right? Pretend. I like this. I kind of do. I think I do. And over here, I kept this. This is actually a peninsula where me and an Efo fought. So I was thinking maybe I'm gonna raise a little statue over here and then even invite Zombie Cleo to get and have me and Efo fighting on the top of the statue thingy. Like the, the podium of the statue. You know what I mean, right? I think it's gonna look really nice. But but anywho, ladies and gentlemen, you will have to let me know what you guys think about this. We will be back here uh, to check this out uh, in, uh, in shaders later on to this episode. But now let's head over and check out the button. Ladies and gentlemen, behind me, behold, 
the button. I watched this uh, yesterday when Doc was playing and he sat here all day. So first, first I think Iskal pressed it. Then uh, Brian did it. And then Falsy did it like a sneaky job. <laughs> Poor Doc. But somebody must have been AFK here, by the way. But let's see. The button, Cyclops. What is it? The button is alive and has to be kept alive by being pressed. The closer to death the button is, when you save it, the higher rank you get, signified by a colored belt put on your skin. How does it work? If you press the button, the redstone lamps will fill back up and you get a colored piece of concrete. This is your rank and you should then attach your rank belt to your skin. Belts are in zip on Discord in announcement. Can I customize my belt? Yes, it doesn't even have to be a belt. It just has to be the right color. Do I get a price for saving it in the red? Nope, but everyone will think you're awesome. And purple belts will bow down to you. Did it change? No. Should I laugh at the people who are lower rank than you? Yes, 100% <laughs> yes. Can I press it more than once? Yes, but your belt corresponds to the most recent press, meaning you could drop to a lower rank. There is no gray belt. That is not a rank. Any other questions? Just ask. It's all fun and games, but people with purple belts should be ridiculed. However you pronounce that. Long live the button. Bumbo Mumbo. And the thing is, somebody, somebody must have been AFKing over here. Because obviously this area needs to be loaded to work, right? And it's almost in the yellow. And I only know one person who's got the yellow belt so far. And that is the goat farter. Or maybe somebody else has it. I'm not really sure. But I'm going to be, you know what? I'm going to be standing here. Nobody, nobody puts a baby in the corner. I want my yellow belt. Scary, hairy, laddy. I've heard noises, footsteps to be precise, but nobody's here. Mm -mm, nobody is here. Mm -mm, no, 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 no. Close my eyes. I'm in my happy place. Go to your happy place. Nope. Can't see anybody. The yellow belt will be yours, Kiralis. Yes, it will be. Pretend we don't see anybody. Pretend we don't hear anybody. Nobody's here. Okay, maybe somebody. Who's that? that okay, that is Jevin. He's got the green belt. No, nope, Jevin. No, 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 no. Not like this. I ain't gonna fight you. I'm gonna pretend you don't exist. Go back and forth. So Jevin was like, hey, Kiralis, I ain't gonna snipe ya. And I'm like, oh, really? Is that so? Like, no hermits. No hermits can be trusted during this game. I repeat, nobody can be trusted. Like, look into my eyes, nothing but my eyes. Nobody can be trusted during this game. I don't even know why I want the button. I just want the button. I really want the button. Was that somebody up there? There was somebody up there, right? No, it's my, my belt. You can throw as many rockets as you want. I, 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 I don't care. My eyes are on the button, my eyes are on the button, my mind is on the button, my hand is on the button, and I got big eyes. I'm kind of like a third person. As soon as it goes, chi-ching, is mine. I've got the yellow belt. Got it? Did I win it? I... Why... Why do I even want the belt? I don't even know. I just, I just want it. Who was that? That was... That was Hypno. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got the yellow belt and I'm happy and hands down, I have no idea why I'm happy, but I guess because it's yellow, that's better than green and blue and purple and gray didn't exist, I guess. Credit where credit is due. This looks absolutely amazeballs. Shashwami Void. He has been a busy bee. I'm not sure you guys uh, seen it. But this totally... What is this? Oh, uh, this totally reminds me of the Lego house in uh, Bilund, Denmark. And that is such a magical place. And this is a magical place. And look at this. Brian has expanded to the raft. Oh my, oh my. It is, okay, still sand, gravel, golden carrots. And I believe name tags. And then we have feature stock here. Okay. There's no stock here, seriously. I said soon. More stock soon. More stock coming soon. More stock soon. I'm not sure what he's gonna have in those places, but maybe future stock. I love it. 
this kind of brings back memories because usually me and the family and this is new go to legoland in billund uh, once a year and this year well due to the, to the pandemic that might not happen oh clever girl he made this instead are we even are we selling anything i haven't heard any, any profits yet so maybe we haven't sold any pink is such a nice color hey we made use of this beautiful llamas how do you do this? What are they standing on? This is clever. This is really nice. But let's check this out. Oh, by the way, somebody wrote that in the comment section uh, from the previous episode that I should color them like the B colors, like uh, yellow and black. And that is, uh, that is a nice idea. That might actually happen. But this over here, though, that is, there's gotta be Scar. It has to be Scar. It, it's gotta be Scar. I have not yet watched his latest video, but this this definitely looks like the works of, of Scar. <sighs> He's so good at it. Man, oh, look at that. This is one of those uh, fly eating plants. Who this? That is Scar. I see. I'm not sure what he's gonna be selling over here, but obviously... I don't know. Maybe plants? It's a beautiful botanical garden, nevertheless. Is there anything new? No. N no. Oh, my face. No. Who done this? Beef. Oh, this could only, this can only be one person. Hi, Matilda. Matilda. Matilda, l don't show your butt. I'm, I'm a kind person. I will buy you. For five diamond blocks, I promise you, you will be living with uh, Barakolama back over my base. I, it's gonna be a better place. You will roam the lands freely. Maybe not, but I promise, I'm gonna buy you. All right. I heard you love goats. You're welcome, goat farter. P.S. It's Tugger, not Tucker. <laughs> this is so evil. <laughs> oh man, like. Beef did a, like a modern art installation in his garden and he, he made a huge one and removed the, the llama head, which by the way was beautiful. And look at the tongue. Oh man, can I go, ugh, can I go inside? No, that, uh, my face. Don't worry, I'm alive. Do they, do they still come out over here? Well, well hopefully yes. Man, this is, this is absolutely amazing. And what is this diamond pile? See, this is what I mean. It's such a treat coming to the, to the, to the shopping district because there's so much new stuff. Electric uh, Booga 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 price pool. Oh, I see. Electric Booga Booga uh, participants. Cab e for n Green, Brian, Iskal, Stress, Kiralis, Cleo, Impulse, B, False. The Goat Farter. Uh, Hypno, Scar, Jev, and Joe, Sheshwam, you avoid. You can still sign up. Yeah, I haven't even... I, I don't think I will win. I'm so far behind, it kind of feels like. Is there anything we have missed? I don't want to miss stuff. Profits over it. Oh, yeah. Where's the boomers at? wonder if they've seen my thingy over here. Because we need the ship to be blown. Ba-boom. Yeah. Historical shipwreck needs boom. Okay. Not my neighbor's fishing vessel. He will be sad otherwise. Hopefully we can bring them over and go ba-boom. And looky looky at my bookie. Okay. This is getting really out of hand over here. We need... What we could do maybe get one of those uh, lecterns with a book. And people can sign that instead. And obviously I'm going to take all those rivers we have over here and put it in the book as well. But this... What does it say? Had every book I was looking for... And a reasonable price too. 10 out of 10 will buy again. Will also recommend to all my friends too. Hypno. Well, spank you, Hypno. And you know what? I, I don't think we're going to check the profits today. Because I don't think... Oh, there are two diamonds over here. I don't think there's much profits at all. Who? Who buys an unbreaking book for one diamond only? Ladies and gentlemen. I'm a... Um, I'm a simple man. Ha! <sighs> This looks so nice. There's something about shaders. Uh, oh, that face is nice. There's something about shaders, like just seeing like the shadows drop and the colors just pop. Like, I mean, just look at how vibrant and beautiful over there. 
ay, 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 ay. It's just a whole new game. But I'm not going to be using the Shinos uh, too much this season, mainly because uh, it's going to be very framey here very soon, because I'm adding so much detail and such. So yeah, but uh, you guys will have to let me know what you think about this building so far. We will make it better. If you guys got tips, tricks, suggestions, please do post them in the comment section. Is there a glitch in the matrix? I'm gonna fix that. Because uh, obviously this is kind of like a draft. It is not done yet. Uh, for obvious reasons. Because it's 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 bigger than, ex than I expected it to be. But, uh, ooh. Scary, hairy, lady. Oh, I see you over there. Let's, let's, let's make a round for it. But in the next episode, we're gonna build a crane somewhere over here. Uh, just so we can have a crane going back and forth, back and forth on the rails. Hopefully the boomers will come by and blow up the vessel. Uh, and then we can maybe clear off a little bit of this uh, peninsula. Well, pretty much everything, I guess. Uh, and maybe even make a ship over here. Another one. Another one. I mean, pointless, but hey, it is what it is, right? And, uh, and yeah, I kind of ran out of time. I really wanted to do the crane today. Just gonna tie it together, but uh, yeah, this took so much time so much time especially like just digging out the area but uh, i really hope you guys enjoyed today's episode make sure you leave a like subscribe if you haven't and i am Kralis, and i will see you guys in the next episode of hermitcraft but uh is this cookie on cookie kaka pa kaka is this too much nah it can never be too much detail right yeah no no i can see balls from here because i'm a real boy i like it leave a like have a very nice day. I am Kralis, and I will see you guys in the next episode of Hermitcraft. Ha! <sighs> Ta-da! My face. There it is. Bye, everybody.